Hi, I'm Mary Beth. Hi, I'm Nicole. This is my Audi. This is my Audi. <laughs> Hi, my name's Justine. I'm Jalene. I'm Will. <laughs> Hi, I'm Jalene, and this is Justine. She's my Ate, and this is Will. He's my Audi. <laughs> How's it going? My name is Ronzel. I'm Alex. I'm Ethan. And I'm Andrew. I'm the Kuya of these three. And our family is <laughs> POH, AKP, and Sweet Cheeks! Yeah! <laughs> hey guys, my name is John Ezekiel Moya, or as many of you already know me, my name is Kel. And I am Kuya Josh. I'm this guy's Kuya. And I'm his Odding. And um, we're gonna go tell you guys more about AKAs. AKA mean to you? I guess I kind of answered that before. It's the mentorship, um, having someone to guide as an ate and as an adding, having someone to look up to and guide you through college. So AKA stands for uh, ate kuya adding, and to me, it's about um, making connections with um, people that I normally couldn't make um, outside of Capamilia. The best thing about being an adding is looking up to your ate or kuya, especially transitioning into your first year of college. I definitely agree with that because coming into college, I, I felt like it was really hard to adjust to everything. And when I, was, I met Drew, it, it became a lot easier to adjust. And he was always there and he was helping me through tough times, which I really appreciate. Yeah, and if it weren't for Drew, we wouldn't be as Close. <laughs> One of the basic things that you can do with your Odding or Kuya is spend time with them. Um, I know me and Kuya Josh last year especially, we used to love to go out all the time. Right, right. Almost every day. Yeah. <laughs> but yeah, it's like the simple pleasures of yeah. like being like a Kuya, just like taking out your Odding. And another thing was um, the fact that you have someone who's older than you, who's already been through college and has experienced like what it's like, especially signing up for classes or who's for teaching classes, um, how certain professors are like, and you just have someone that you can go to as a reference. And being an Odding, I think, has just been really life-changing because I don't think I'd be where I am if I hadn't uh, had Kuya Josh as an Odd, uh, Kuya. You can't make the heart, but it's okay. <laughs> <laughs> so the best part about being a Kuya, it's all fun and games, but at the same time, it's all about responsibility and teaching these three on how to be a good Kuya and a good Ate. For me, the best thing, obviously me, the best thing about being an ate is just having that um, mentor-mentee uh, relationship. Both Nicole and I are both nursing majors, and even though I'm only a semester above her, it's, um, it's the thing that's kept me the closest with her, um, even though we spent a year and a half online with school and not really getting to see each other very often. Having that mentor relationship is really what got me into the AKA program and it's the one thing I really push for and I just like to hear from my Odding what she's experiencing with clinicals and I know she likes to hear from me what I'm experiencing and so she gets to know what she can look forward to in the future. If you guys are hesitant in joining AKA, I say don't. Don't. <laughs> just don't. Because Please don't. <laughs> We were blessed by this guy. And if it weren't for him, I don't know how we'd make it this far at Dominican University of California, you know? And AKA has definitely been one of the things that's brought me close to my ate and then my odding and my fam as a whole. Like it's something I truly hold personally in my heart. Yeah, me too. <laughs> <laughs>